Hello and welcome. Let's look inside the project folder you have downloaded. In tutorial folder you will find guides and material links from the project. The quick preview of all scenes available in composition previews folder. Project files includes project itself and its assets. Very important thing is fonts. They have to be installed before using project. You can change it later. Before install project into DaVinci Resolve we need to copy the assets folder to the specific location. The locations are different for Windows and Mac OS users, here they are. After that we can install the project itself by open a DRFX file. It will open DaVinci Resolve where you need to click install button. Done! You will find audio visual kit and effects window in title section. All elements have preview pictures and grouped by categories. The project was created for full HD in 30 frames per second. So let's set out project settings to 1920 by 1080 in 30 frames per second. Now we can create a timeline to start using the project. Put your mouse over the element to see animated previews. And then just drag the scene you like to your timeline. It will appear in 5 seconds long clip. But you can make it longer as you need, up to 1 hour. To change layer length select change clip duration from the right click menu. All animations will be kept after retiming the scene. All controls you need you will find an inspector window on the right. If scene have a gray placeholder it means you can add your content to this scene. To do this import media you like. Select clip and hit magic wand icon on the top right corner. It will switch to fusion view. Here we need to connect media node to out scene. Drag photo to the grid and connect it to yellow triangle on the scene node. Use controllers to fit your media into placeholder. You can move, scale, and rotate it. Now we can go back to edit page. Change text, fonts, colors, and etc. from the inspector window. I will make a quick edit here to make this scene look more unique. In some scenes there are two or three social media icons, they are also customizable. Change media icon from drop down menu, theme of the icon, or just turn it off if you don't need it. To edit playlist text columns use tab key and activate fusion overlay view to see column dividing bars. Tab key will help you to make big and clean spaces between words. Also sometimes there are selection of some special line in playlist. It has its own controllers. Audio visualization and podcasts are available in vertical and square formats, so you can use them anywhere you need.
Visit easyedit.pro for more.